Right now, I'm behind the scenes at a boudoir photo shoot led by two photographers, Juliet and Fanny. Now, through their work, they hope to dismantle maybe that outdated idea that this type of photography is inappropriate or even gauche. So we're gonna talk with Juliet and Fanny right after this in studio, but right now, I get to speak with some of the women who they're empowering one photograph at a time, starting with Sarah Jane. Sarah Jane, is this your first time doing something like this? Yes, it is. Oh my gosh, how do you feel? I feel nervous. Yeah? I, yeah, more nervous than I thought I would be. Yeah, you're gonna be a model. Yeah. So I've got lots of questions. Like, specifically, what led you to this moment right now? What made you wanna do this? In my life, one of the things I've experienced is intimate partner violence. Mm -hmm. And it left me with a very negative and complicated relationship with my own body. And so I wanted to do this to feel confident, to feel beautiful, to feel empowered, and to connect my, with myself in a way that I haven't before. And um, I'm really looking forward to this experience. You're taking control of the situation. I am, yes. This is beautiful, I'm so excited for you. Halle, what made you decide to do a boudoir photo shoot? So I had dabbled with boudoir back when I was an undergrad. Yeah. And you know, you grow up and your body goes through a lot of changes <laughs> and a lot happens in your life that sometimes you don't have control over. Mm -hmm. And a lot of moments can slip away if you mm -hmm. don't like capture them sometimes. Like sometimes I'll look back and really wish I had taken a photo. And that's kind of how I feel about boudoir photo shoots. Like we're so much kinder to ourselves when we look back at photos. If you're having a bad day and you're scrolling through your Instagram feed or you're scrolling through your photos and you see that, you're like, I look damn good that day. I have about like four or five of them hanging in my bathroom right now. Oh my <laughs> gosh. So every time you go into the washroom, you're like, yes, yeah, me. Like, oh. Once the photo shoot was done and over with, um, I started to explore myself a lot um, and sort of realized that I was non-binary. Wow. Um, and that was like a really cool moment for me. So Sarah Jane, this is your big reveal. Are you ready? I don't know. <laughs> I think so. Okay, let's do it. Oh my God. All right. Oh my God. <laughs> That's how to get started. Yeah, yeah. I love that one. That's funny as well. That's gasp worthy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's really um, weird to see myself this way. It's. Um, I feel like I'm looking at somebody else. It's. Uh, I didn't know I could do that. Mm. You know. <laughs> I actually have to tell you something really important about this particular shot because I had to look at my own reflection for an extended period of time. Mm -hmm. Most of us don't do that. No. And I was able to, mm -hmm. and considering I've had so many body image issues because of my experiences, I was able to look at my own reflection and I felt positive and beautiful and strong and powerful and confident the entire time. And I, that's never happened to me before. Yeah, that was a that was a, a huge moment for me. Wow. Well, I'm glad you were able to feel this way. Yeah, that's me yeah. feeling that way yeah. in that picture wow, right now. Yes, yeah, that's, that's you actually. So <laughs> th thank you for that. Thank All you right. for that gift. Thank you. Hey there! Wasn't that great? Do you know where you can find some equally good content? Our YouTube page. It's filled with discussions, debates, and some laughs. Head there now, like and subscribe.